and next coming to the basic concepts in the basic concepts first one is the rigid body rigid body rigid body in the sense suppose consider a body consider a body whenever i have applied a force in this particular body whenever a force is applied when there is no deformation takes place nothing but the size and shape are fixed even after the application of force then that particular body is said to be a rigid body but it is an ideal condition ideal condition in the sense no in, no body in the universe is a rigid body because after the application of force the size and shape will be changed it means some deformation will be produced in the body but for our convenience in the engineering mechanics every body is considered to be a rigid body only just for our convenience what is mean by rigid body rigid body in the sense an idealized body an idealized body an idealized body whose size and shape are fixed whose size and shape are fixed whose size and shape are fixed size and shape are fixed fixed and remain unaltered and remain unaltered in the sense does not change and remain unaltered and remain unaltered when forces are applied when forces are applied and forces are applied it is in the sense there is no effect produced by this particular force on this body that means no deformation takes place in the body and next coming to the flexible body flexible or elastic flexible or elastic body it is opposite to the rigid body the application of force on the body produces some deformation in the body it means deformation takes place it means deformation takes place all the bodies are in the universe are said to be elastic body but rigid body does not exist rigid body does not exist in the universe all the bodies are said to be elastic body it is also said to be inelastic body inelastic body and this is said to be elastic body this effect produced by this body will produce some deformation in the body then that is said to be a elastic or flexible body next mass 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 is nothing but the quantity of matter present in the body this is a body having a certain type of mass mass is nothing but the quantity of matter present in the body the quantity of matter the quantity of matter present in the body the quantity of matter present in the body is said to be mass the quantity of matter present in the body is said to be mass next vector 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 a quantity which has both magnitude and direction a quantity which has both magnitude plus direction is said to be vector suppose if force is a vector acceleration acceleration velocity is a vector because indicates velocity that is nothing but meters per second its units are velocity suppose only we cannot define velocity with only its magnitude suppose its magnitude is in the speed that is means 20 km per hour indicates the magnitude in the sense of the velocity but in which direction in east to west direction 